So Sam, first game of the playoffs, first win, that's not a bad way to do it. No, it's not. I think it was um, it's a great win for us that. I think um, a big part of it is being here at home and I think that home advantage was massive for us. I think you know, we've got the best fans and um, you know, they follow us home and away, but certainly at home that you know they're, they're our extra player and I think um, tonight they, they, they sort of really turned out for us. Sean, sure, when you went to bed last night, was that what you dreamt of? Yeah, it was a matter of fact. Yeah, I, I, I didn't sleep well last night. You know, the game kept me awake, and and uh, I mean that's credit to Catalan. You know, they're a quality team, quality coach, and they're a threat. And, and to deal with them the way we dealt them tonight was outstanding. You know, I thought we scored some great tries, but our defence was great. I thought, you know, they, they have threats all over the park, as they've showed. You know, they beat a lot of teams the last few weeks and got into fourth position. So I'm, I'm really pleased with the performance. I thought we had a real dig, and and everything about the game plan worked, worked fantastic. The well, you know, I've had. A, Quite a few players what's not trained this week. Six or seven players not trained this week. Uh, seven or eight players have had injection before the game. So uh, when you consider that and, and not having a real good week at training, to come out with that performance was was absolutely fantastic. And when we spoke earlier in the week, you mentioned uh, Catalan's real tough middle that they had and you wanted to combat that. And with their props going off injured, that, that about sums that up, doesn't it? Yeah, good, it was a good feeling. You know, I'm not saying I want them to be injured, but it shows that our, our, our defence was good. You know, it was. It was. I went, I went big on my bench, and, and I thought we were going for the three foot rovers. We could, we could play them in shorter spells, but very intense spells, and that's what we did. It was good. I thought, oh, you know, Ben Flower and Gil Dudson and Lee Mossup, Jeff Lima, Amelawaki. I thought they was all really, really strong, and, and, and I thought they dominated the middle. They, they make us look good a lot of the time. We don't get enough credit for it. Um, but yeah, I think you know there was some great execution as well from from the backs, and altogether a, a victory. We're certainly happy with. Yeah, very disappointing tonight. Um, we build ourselves up for a big game, and we're going to, you know, top of the table. We, we really thought we were in with a shot tonight, but yeah, disappointing. And coming to their place on a, you know, a Friday night, it, it's a tough, tough occasion. And uh, but you've you've sort of left yourself enough room with winning so many through the season to to play on next week. Yeah, like uh, luckily enough that we played well enough this year to to get another shot and. Hopefully we can uh, turn it around. Um, we talked about in the dressing room sticking together, and no, it's definitely not over for us. Like we, we still think we're a good chance this year. I haven't been back long, but um, you know, I've had a few few different games and a few different situations, you know. And hopefully uh, that that'll put us in good stead and put win the playoffs. Um, you know, when any situations thrown at us, you know, we've shown we've shown we can come back from from being down, and um, you know, we can go on with it as well. So it's it's you know, everyone's excited at the moment, but. Now we're going to work hard training the next week and a bit and um, prepare ourselves for that next game. And that guy just inside of you, George Kamitz, running in three tries today. Uh, how did it look from the, just outside of him? Oh, I love, love playing with Georgie. Um, you know, everyone's in his ear about staying another year. You know, his age is not a, you know, an object to him. You know, look at Steve Menzies, he's still going around at whatever um, age he is. So, you know, Georgie's playing great footy and, um, you know, he's, he's just working hard like everyone else in the team to, to you know, finish the season off well. This, this couple of weeks now will do a world of good and you know I, I just want to make sure that in a couple of weeks time we go on here and we're absolutely physically with, with, with feeling fit and strong and very skillful and you know this extra week will do us, will do us a world of good this period in, in the season. And you know you mentioned there's a few errors that you need to tidy up on putting a 40 point margin between you and Catalan that's got to sort of uh, spell fear among the rest of the people in the competition really. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not trying to be smart though. Uh, I, I genuinely think that Liam Fowler for one, dropping them two balls and and people like that, there's, there's things what we can do better, you know. But I, I don't want to that, take, take that away from the performance. I'm really happy with the performance, but I still think we can squeeze a bit better out of our attack. And I thought our defence was was superb. So moving on, confident that you can get to that grand final and then still hopeful that you can win it. Um, I'm very hopeful. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not. I'm not overconfident about the semi-final. You know, I, I know if we if we play the way we did today, then we'll trouble lots of teams. If we look after the ball and 84% completion today, if we can do that, then we we'll give ourselves a, a great chance of winning and getting to the grand final. But I, I don't just want to get there. I just want to make sure I win the semi final and, and, and win the grand final. If I if I'm looking to get there, but there's some great teams still out there and a lot of our work to do. And but, you know, make no bones about it. I think we give ourselves a good chance today.